thinking person helped police catch two men. They say robbed a Newport News pharmacy. And not only did they write down the license plate number of the getaway car, they also gave police a description of the suspects. And those two things helped police track down and arrest Robert Shile and Matthew Sherman, who you're seeing. It happened Saturday afternoon at the Rite Aid on Warwick Boulevard. Turn on your side, Ava Hurdle joins us from police headquarters with what the men took and more on their bold moves. Ava. Anita, one of the men apparently jumped over the pharmacy counter, demanded and got OxyContin, some 970 pills worth. Police say 22-year-old Robert Shalee Jr. and 24-year-old Matthew Sherman were armed when they walked into this Rite Aid, intent on getting OxyContin, a highly addictive prescription drug, to package and to sell. They go for about a dollar, 50 cent to a dollar a milligram, and some of the pills themselves were 80 milligrams. Oxycontin is what's called a synthetic opiate, locked away at the pharmacy until one of the suspects demanded the drugs at gunpoint. A prescription is needed to get Oxycontin legally. It gives you a high. It's also a pain reliever. And it. Um, some people get addicted to it because of previously being prescribed them. Police say the suspects got away with 970 pills, but they were nabbed 12 hours later. Someone saw them getting away and called police with a description of the vehicle. Very aware of her surroundings, uh, was paying attention, and uh, was able to give us an exact tag number. And that, that's, we usually don't get that. And without it, we probably would not have solved this crime. Sandy Saunders, a customer, said the drugs are probably headed for their use or to sell. I guess they figure they're desperate and they'll do anything. But uh, I'm glad the citizen came up and uh, got the information so that the police could get it. Police recovered the pills, which they say are purchased on the street by people in their teens and early 20s. Now we're told this is a growing trend now linked to violent crime. Both men remain behind bars tonight. We're live in Newport News Police Headquarters, Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side. A good night.